Hey guys, um, welcome back to the channel. Um, today, it's already <laughs> afternoon, but um, it's already almost one actually. But on Wednesdays, it's a little bit hard to uh, film because one goes in late um, and two come home early. So by the time I get the last one out, it's almost time for the other two to get home. So um, baby and I are having our lunch right now. And um, I do plan on going to the store um, later. I want to um, run by Walgreens and um i'm thinking either ross or target i'm looking for a um toy bin like a the cloth kind um just to corral all the all of the baby's toys downstairs her and eden both are usually in the office with me a lot of times so i want um, something that will keep the area looking neat when they're not in there but uh it avoids me having to lug the toys back and forth um you know just keep them corralled in something that looks decent if i can find an ottoman um then that would be good too um because i plan on taking the one that's been in my office out and put it into the living room because it doesn't match that couch anymore and the grays the hues of gray um, that I have in my office are a lot lighter um, than what that ottoman is. And our couch is actually a dark gray. So I plan on swapping that out. So if I can find an ottoman, I may just do that. Um, but if not, a toy box will do too um, because I need one anyway. So thinking about that. Although I do have something that may work. It's kind of big though. So I'll check and see. I was having my little leftover. I had half of it yesterday and half today. That's the broccoli salad that they carry at Kroger or Fries. If you guys have one of those stores in your area. It's at the deli. Somebody is very impatient for their food. Um, but yeah. It's really good. I'm going to have to figure out how to make it myself because um, it's not cheap. It's like $4.99 a pound. And this little container um, was almost the full $5. So, yeah. I'm going to have to figure out how to make that on my own. And I'm almost positive I know how to do it. I just have to figure out what the sauce is. Um, the dressing that they use for it. Once I do that, then... I'm good to go. That's usually what I do. <laughs> I find a food that I like, I taste it, and then I figure out what's in it, and then I make it myself. So, there you go. Because your girl's cheap. So, anyway, um, I'll probably get back with you guys once we head out. Um, like I said, the kids will be home in just a little bit, so I'll probably head out once they get here. So, yeah, if we head out and go anywhere, then I'll take you guys with me. What's the matter with you, little lady? Nothing to say now? Mm-hmm. All eyes on you, huh? Yeah. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> so, it has been a day. Um, I've been cleaning up and getting everything um, back to zero pretty much um, I didn't show a lot of the cleaning but what I am cleaning right now is the washing machine and um, I am notorious for cleaning the things that I use to clean other things if that makes sense um, so the, it just drives me crazy to have like a dirty washing machine, especially with these older agitator ones. I should have showed you the before, but it always starts to collect a lot of grime and stuff right there. And then, you know, the other parts, well, it's the lighting in here is not great. I want to change the fixture out at some point, but, um, and the camera I'm filming on for some reason doesn't show the lighting great. But anyhow, um, yeah, I got in there and cleaned all the little edges and all of that. 
So I'm, I'm going to run it and let it go ahead and do its thing. I'm just going to throw a little bleach in. Um, but yeah, I get in there <laughs> and I scrub it really well. So I'm going to let that run and then I'm going to... And then I'm going to head back into the kitchen. I already did the dishes and now I'm going to try to straighten up the living and dining room area um, and see how that goes. Um, pretty much good with dinner for tonight because we have a rotisserie chicken and some leftovers. Um, I did the Mississippi beef. So I'm good on that part, but yeah, let me show you what it looks like right now. So somebody's been in here, the little one apparently, that's her signature. So I did all the dishes except for whatever we had for lunch, the girls and I. I was doing a haul, so that stuff is still there. but. Um, I need to clear this table, all the old mail. Still trying to get it together from coming back. And then um, we've been doing Legos, me and Eden. And the baby's been wreaking havoc with all her stuff. So I'm going to clear this up and get the living room back to zero. And so I can look it can be halfway decent sorry about the lighting in here guys but anyway um it's also hair day so i just finished um eden's hair and um mama's tired i am i would love to just sit down and put my feet up but i still have things to do you feel me all right let's keep going Hey guys, so I ran out to um, Target um, a minute ago and I didn't film because the baby was pretty fussy most of the time. So um, I want and I ran into Ross too. I was looking for a bin for her toys to put in my office, but that was a bus. So it wasn't worth filming to show you guys that. It was just literally ran in really quick. Um, I'm in my closet right now. This is what it kind of looks like. Um, and the reason I'm in here is because, uh, of course, I've been doing mountains of laundry, like you see in the last vlog. Um, but I am working on putting away, like, my house clothes type of things. Um, and I need to pare down on some of these shirts. I have an excessive amount of shirts and some of them are starting to get really worn out and not so great um, like these items here I pull these from when I did the laundry so they're washed um, so I'm just gonna bag those up I've been keeping a little bag down on the ground of stuff that needs to go out and then I will send it off to the Goodwill so um, I'm just gonna go through that stack right there um, the rest of the stuff is um, shirts that need to be hung. Um, and then kind of try to see how I do the filing system. But um, I've, I started going through. I'm going to pull what either doesn't fit or it's not like super great. Um, and then just pare down some. I just want to have one row of like the fitted tees. And then I have one of t-shirts. And then those are like a couple of long sleeves and I put shorts and stuff like here. Um, but yeah, it's just too much. So I'm going to work on that and okay, see what I so I have a visitor, <laughs> a grumpy one. So anyway, um, this is what I went through and these are the ones that I'm probably going to go ahead and get rid of. So you can see. They're nice. Shirts. Like these are nicer shirts, but some of them I'm just not gonna wear again. Um, and then I pulled a dress out. 
and those are the ones I showed before. And then I got a couple of items from in the drawer. This was hanging up as well, but I got a few pieces. So it's a little bit more organized. That's my limit. And I'm going to go over that. And I have space for more t-shirts, but I don't want any more. And then I don't have any shorts. There are more winter pieces that I think I'll probably end up pulling, but I'm going to see if I actually wear them this winter or not. Um, same with down here. Probably a couple pairs of shorts and jeans that I'll probably get rid of as well. So, so I guess we'll see how that all goes as time goes by. Figure out what to do with this little baby of ours. It is... 1 30 so i just finished eating and um i just lo i'm just putting all the dishes in the sink um but yeah i had bacon and eggs some of that bacon that i got in the um, winco haul the pepper bacon it was really good it almost tasted like a smoked um brisket um but it was really good um hubby made me some scrambled eggs and so I just did that. Didn't have any carbs, no bread, no toast, no um, bagel. So yeah, had that and some orange juice. Um, so that was really yummy. Oh, I'm gonna show you what the cabinet looks like that I did the other day. This is what I ended up with. Um, I put the lunch boxes up there. And then my one like lemonade jug and then this one has a couple of bowls and stuff for Eden to be able to reach for in the afternoon because she's forever asking someone for <laughs> to get her a bowl so I figured I put it down to her level um, just a larger Tupperware and stuff I used to like season meat and stuff like that and then over here I used the basket that I got from Target. I'm pretty sure I showed that the other day. I got this size and then the larger one that I put the waters in, in the other pantry. Um, and then this is all their um, lunch stuff. So they can come here, pull this out, get their cups and um, like their little thermos and snack containers, sandwiches, um, whatever they need from school. Push that back. And then that is that. And then grab their lunchbox and they're off. Somebody has something they don't have any business having. Yes, that puts a smile on your face every time, doesn't it? So this is what I pulled out of the other drawer when I was cleaning it out. And I did just redo it a couple months ago. So you always can manage to pull out weed out a couple more things um, when you go back through and reorganize a, you know, a few times in, uh, every, every couple of months. So um, these little plastic containers and some random lid. I don't even know why those were under there, but that will go. Goodwill recycling and we're done with that. And then over here, this is what it looks like now. So I put the plastic a um, few little like lunch containers for my husband and random ones like if like this one came from somebody else's house so that'll probably go back and then their little soup bowls that I got from the holler hall way back and then down here um, I put the glass ones so a couple of them are brand new in the back and then these ones we've been using so once I get the rest of them out of the dishwasher Hello, are you my helper? <laughs> then they'll go in there. So that was my solution to that problem. And then I got my um, box of vases that I'm gonna move into the laundry room. Yes, I see that. Can I put this away now? Thank you. So yeah, it always pays just to go back through your cabinets every now and then and that way you can see um, if you're still using everything, same with your closets and, you know, clothes, shoes, that sort of thing, just to make sure that you're actually, you know, still using them. Um, 
when I was at Target, they had a deal on the plum uh, organic foods. They had a, a deal on them. If you buy 15, you got a $5 gift card. I think they were like a dollar and some change a piece. So, um, oh, and they had a 25% off cartwheel. So somebody's going to have lots of little snacks. Yeah. So I got that and I also got um, the pea crisps for her to try. We're going to give those a shot. And I got, okay, this is easier to see. So I got some of these Dove Men Plus Care. Um, I got three boxes of these, three packages, and they come with four bars. They were five and some change. If you buy four items, you got a $5 gift card for that as well. Um, so I got those for him, and I stocked up because they never have this scent, and this is the one he likes, the minerals and sage. And then I got myself this, because I've tried it. I was at TJ Maxx one time, and they had it for like $2.99. And I was like, oh, let me just give this stuff a try. And I actually really loved it. Um, so I'm always on the lookout for it because it's expensive. It was like $5.69, and that's pricey. So, But they had, I think, 10% off the Dove items for women, the Dove Dry Spray and Elements um, deodorant. So I got that. And then for baby, this. This tiny wonder. That. And then, hold on. And then that one, really cute. And that whole set was only $6.98. It was 30% off. So, that was cool. I think that was everything. So, yeah, that was everything that I got. So, um, Target run. So this little one's super tired, but she won't take a nap. So she's following me around as I'm trying to clean up. I'm trying to work in my bedroom today in my closet. Um, as you've probably seen in the clip before this, I think. But anyhow, um, I was trying to get a bin for the toys that I keep in here for her, but. That was a bust at Ross, so that's okay. I'll keep a lookout, and I'm just going to keep working in my closet and still have some um, clean clothes to put away from my trip, believe it or not. Yes, don't judge me, still. And um, so I'm hanging that stuff now. And kind of just weeding through and seeing what I want to keep, what I want to get rid of. And my room needs a really bad clean. Um, so yeah, I'm going to work on that. <laughs>